The Safer Nursing 24-7 project is designed to improve patient safety and to improve the health, safety and well-being of nurses. New approaches to managing fatigue and shift work in nursing are needed because nurses' workloads are increasing and because DHB funding is limited. The Health and Safety at Work Act is also tightening up on the management of hazards in the workplace. The good news is that new science is giving us better solutions to these challenges. The project team brings together scientific and nursing expertise from Massey University and the New Zealand Nurses Organisation. It also has an advisory group representing key stakeholders, but we need your input. The project is independently funded by the Health Research Council, Lottery Grants Board, McCutcheon Trust and Massey University. We now understand that fatigue is the result of not having enough recovery from all of your waking activities and that sleep is absolutely vital for recovery. We function best if we can have unrestricted sleep at night. But obviously that's not possible when you have to be caring for patients at night. There are times of the day when you feel more sleepy. In the early hours of the morning, and then later again in the middle of the afternoon if you haven't had enough sleep. Shift work can interfere with your sleep if it requires you to be working when your circadian body clock says that you ought to be asleep. And this includes early starts and late finishes as well as night work. International studies show that getting less sleep on work days increases nurses' risk of clinical errors, of personal harm injuries at work, and of drowsy driving on the way home from work. The new approach moves the focus from managing the length of shifts to managing fatigue-related risk across different shifts, and from managing the length of rest breaks to managing the availability of recovery sleep opportunities. The project is ready to go, but we can't succeed without you in three main activities. There's an online survey of the work patterns of nurses working in six practice areas. If you work in one of these areas, please take the time to complete the online survey. This will help us assess the risk associated with different work patterns. Second, there is new education and training materials on how shift work can affect fatigue and how you can improve your sleep, particularly if you're working shifts. Keep your eye on the website for how you can be involved in trialling these new materials. Third, there'll be a new code of practice for shift work and hospital-based nursing. We'll be looking for your input as it gets developed. Together, we can create positive change.